Looks like that game is going to start for another half an hour. So, wonderful. I know. We're going to look at what else there is. So, I'm hopping in server number two now. Boom, we're in. And we'll turn it over to the game stuff. There we go. Yeah, we're not going to wait 30 minutes. We're going to get right into whatever we can. Indeed, which is going to happen here in just a few minutes, as you can see by the typing here. <laughs> So the first big draft tournament in quite a while, and the first map is going to be Sunstar, or is this just, uh, we're just waiting to switch I honestly don't em. know. Well, let me check. Not that we haven't seen some pretty exciting rounds of Sunstar, but... It's true, it's just not very fast, let's be honest. <laughs> yeah, one would think it would be as uh, compact as it is, but... I think the unusual nature of the flag stand and the weird routes you have to do and so forth kind of slow it down a bit. Plus, right. it's pretty wide open for snipers. It is, yeah, very true. Um, so, they are playing two maps for the round robins. There are imps. Uh, I don't know if there's any... Yeah, no stealth packs. Good. That's fine. Uh, it looks like the first map actually is going to be Arx Novena. Classic. Classic. Classic, all right. Absolutely classic. <laughs> yeah, Arx Novena is uh, probably one of the venerable maps of Tribes of Sin. It was not originally in the game. They added it uh, shortly after it came out, but it proved to be very, very popular and still is. And that one definitely has a lot of options for, for cappers and for different styles of play so it gives all these teams a little bit of a chance to work on different ways to utilize their good players and figure out who are their good players and what their strengths and weaknesses are and i would like to give a shout out to adhesive wombat they are the uh group of music that you hear tonight uh all, all of their music right now. Uh, and most of their music was actually featured in a little old game that I liked that never really took off because I, I guess the dev started to being an a-hole. But, uh, uh... No. Uh, what, oh, God, what... Oh, uh... The War Z? No, 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 no. The, um... <laughs> no, 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 no. It was a game that we were talking about covering, but it just never took off. But it was a, um... R robot roller derby disco dodgeball. Disco dodgeball, yeah, yes. that's still around. Yeah, they are. Uh, they're starting to do a Friday night thing. I think. Ooh, nowadays. we should start getting in on that because that is a fun game. Well worth. I love that game. I, it's so much fun, and it's a, it's simple, and the soundtrack is amazing, and yeah, I highly suggest checking it out on Steam. It's like, it was twenty bucks. I don't know if it is anymore. It might be just ten now, but. I would they don't zap it. you on Twitch for using that music. They do on YouTube. No, they haven't. Yeah, they haven't yet. I've well, used it we're working times. on that. I can announce this uh, that IBN will be 
having a free music library. It's a new thing we're working on. And so we'll be royalty free, contract free. You'll be able to use the music for your streams or your videos or whatever projects you've got going on. And we'll be uh, adding to that on a monthly basis and adding new tunes to it so you know after Excellent. a few months we should build up something pretty substantial it's something that streamers really need right now i mean we're in a weird time of copyrights and dmca notices and things like that there's really a need for more good royalty free music without having to sell out to some corporate bullshit seriously <laughs> We'll be uh, letting you know more about that very soon. Looking forward to it. Actually, one of the interesting things about uh, uh, Project Z <clears throat> was the guy that they have on, on staff. I need to check up on this, but his name is Cruncha. Now, Cruncha is also the name of a DJ that I hired. Well, not hired, but he did a lot of music for old CSR and IBN way back in the day. It's from Hawaii. Mm -hmm. uh, and then I heard one of his songs got picked up for a porno. Oh, wow. <laughs> Always a, uh, a hallmark of the industry. If you Indeed. Get in. But he had a song that I still have in my library that is a, uh, like a techno remix of uh, Snake Man from Mega Man 3. And it was fantastic. Oh, nice. And he, he also sure, made the uh, old idea. doing audio for Project City, yes. Yeah, and he, he also made the, uh, the old uh, IBN intro way back in the day. Cool. Oh, and there's uh, Fictious linking Crunch's SoundCloud. There you go. We'll see if it's the same guy. I think it is, to be perfectly honest. I don't know. but. Okay. Yeah, I wasn't Definitely sure uh, who was doing their audio. I'm, I'm pretty sure I know uh, who's working with Freefall on their audio, but not Project Z. <laughs> Looking forward to that. But uh, here we are. We are on Arx Novena getting ready to play map number one here. And Rigno. these team names are... Um, well, let's we'll take a look here. Let's see. Up. We have Redneck. And so that is... Um, hang on. I have a feeling we're going to resort to Red and Blue and <laughs> Diamond Sword and Blood Eagle. Or blood sword, diamond eagle, whatever the hell it is. Well, it's been here a while. we go. Okay, so I know that <laughs> it, a lazy's team because of resident redneck, and then um, look around trying to find someone else. The bioderms and the yeah, very deep lore of Star Siege tribes. So it's lazy's team versus. Uh, easy. The red team. Yes, the red team. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Here we go. I got it. And angry Pollock's team. There we go. Angry Pollock's team angry versus Pollock. so Lazy's team. We have Angry's awful amateurs versus Lazy's lacking losers. Nice. And remember, there is a five hundred American dollar prize pool for this thing, so a lot is on the line, and it has brought out some of the finest in Tribes of Sin, and some I, I don't know uh, when the last time they even played Tribes of Sin was, but they are back, Indeed. and Tribes of Sin is happening here on a Saturday afternoon. Very excited. Very excited. Let me turn this up a little bit. There we go. All right. Still waiting. Uh, looks like we have 14 in the server. Waiting for uh, things to That's start good. going. I'm not sure what team is on what. So, and I'm, I'm not going to update the scores like that um, with the team names. I will be showing this yeah. screen quite a bit. So you just have to figure it out yourself because that's just way too much switching back and forth. It's old school, man. Oh, yeah. That's how old we school. used to do it back in the day. Love it. Wonder Dog, welcome, sir. Welcome. Old school TSN Center right there, my friends. Awesome. I remember Wonder Dog. 
Oh yeah, Wonder Dog stopping in. Hello. Gotta love it. All right, we're gonna drop down the music here. We're about to start. TSN made me a winner. Indeed. <laughs> they are, they are the reason I do this. To be perfectly honest. And Warwitch started it all. Yep. I usually would say that I remember when he uh, casted one of my team's uh, Wolfenstein games, but I don't want to make him feel old or nothing. <laughs> oh, I already, I already made him feel old. I was like, growing up, <laughs> right out of college, <laughs> I was introduced to shoutcasting. I blame him entirely. And yeah, Wonder Dogs, I'm sorry. <laughs> nice. So here we go. Still waiting. That looks like they're dropping. What? Let's see what's going on. It looks like a couple of people are no. just reconnecting, maybe. Yeah, reconnecting. Okay. Bum -ba -da -bum, ba -da -ba -da -ba -bum. So yeah, not sure what team is on what. I We've already we had one team my... delay because one of the players wanted to take a shower. So fresh, so clean. So I guess that is this community. Okay, so Yod's coming in to sub. Snowier um, chocolate. What was it? Snowier fudge. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna miss. I'm gonna. I, I was looking forward to saying that name, but I guess Please. he just disappeared after he signed up and got drafted. So Yod's famous Euro player coming in as a sub for Lazy's team. It looks like. And Snowier chocolate was a Tayzonde song, I think. LC and T. I play Wolfenstein ET more than I play Tribes. Well, let's be honest. I mean, I only play Tribes for R Rabbit now. Just random streams here and there. <laughs> Wolfie and, T uh, is still pretty cool. Oh, Wolfie yeah, T is really still is. Uh, Merlinator, famous uh, Warwitch yes. friend. Still casts ET from time to time. Yeah, the MG42 crew. Yes. yes. Well, I don't. The MG42 crew still sticks with the RTCW. Merlin Ayers yeah, which, uh, has cast frankly, is the superior game. There's no question. RTCW? Wolfie T yes. Yeah. It, it just, it, it's, it's a little outdated, so people have a hard time, you know, doing ah, it. If you go to crossfire.nu, you can pick it up for free. There's a, a build of it that's the multiplayer only, so and it uses the release source code, so it, it doesn't violate any... Uh, any of the copyright stuff that we were talking about but it also has a map pack with all the maps that are usually in rotation still to this day so yeah I, still I actually, worth a look i, I, I don't picked know. it up on Wolfie steam T for $2. The, uh, oh yeah well worth it well worth it <laughs> but it doesn't have you know the covert ops you know the infiltrator of uh wolfenstein so we are just that nice rock paper scissor balance of things. I'm sorry, I'm, no, I'm no reminiscing problem. about Wolfenstein, and we're uh, <laughs> about to get on with Tribes Sin here. Indeed. Okay, Dortmunder. Nice. Uh, there are eight teams. Uh, right now, we're still waiting on uh, the first match to start. We were gonna watch another one, uh, but one of the members decided to take a shower and postponed it in half an hour. Mm -hmm. And we're still waiting. It looks like a couple of the members went ahead and uh, dropped and reconnecting now. We're too short of getting this thing started. First map is going to be Arx Novena. Eight teams, $500 US dollar purse. Um, it's split up. I believe the captain gets like $67 or something like that. But uh, the top three teams do get money. And yeah, any donations made after the 500 mark have been put to the second tournament. And I think uh, IBN might throw down a couple bucks for that one. Oh, cool. Yes. Uh, Tommy doesn't like my overlay. Too bad. I could, I could, I could do this, <laughs> it, it's but that's so just fancy. boring. That's just boring. No, you want to see fancy? Check that out. Hey, that is fancy. All right. That is fancy.